Hi everyone. In this session, I'm going to teach you that what exactly the data quality is all about when we are talking about the DWH data warehouse testing. So the five to six steps you being as a software tester must know and must have the competency. You as a tester are responsible for completeness of the records. If the records are not complete, you need to communicate with the development team and or the business analyst, which will be helping you for uh, creating and summarizing the information. And uh, for the complex queries, if you are not very much sound for writing the queries, then your development team will help you uh, and facilitate you here. And number second, you being as a software tester, ETL tester must needs to test about the data consistency, that the data is sensible, the data makes sense, which you are fetching from your data warehouse or the data lake. And the number third step, you need to make sure the conformity. Like this is the, uh, the data which you are presenting is what exactly the communicating the same language as per the client requirements or not. And the accuracy of the data is how much your data is accurate with respect to your customer requirement. The number fifth step, you need to concentrate about the integrity of the data. And integrity of the data means that all the business rules, primary key to foreign key, uh, the constraints, are they properly applied or not? And if the constraints are not properly applied, then being as a software tester, your responsibility to ensure this part now. And the timelines that uh, all the stuff are as per the timelines you are producing and if there will be uh, missing the information which are not producing as per the deadlines then you as a tester are responsible in this regard now. Now the question here is what is ETL? ETL is all about in the simple words a process in the data warehouse used to extract the data from the database or the source system and the transforming, placing the data into the data warehouse. In a simple word, I would like to say it is a combination of three database functions. The number first here, you need to extract the information first, and then you need to transform the information. The transformation part is come here. You will be manipulating and uh, playing with the data, uh, which is coming from your source system. And after playing the data and making the meaningful data, uh, the I would like to say the uh, structured data and the unstructured data and transforming the required information then you will be loading the expected targeted system now and this is the simplest way to explain about what is exactly the ETL is all about and being as a software tester each and every single part your role will be to ensure that the data which the development team the queries which they will be writing or the script which will they are writing Either they are following the proper process and reading the data from a single or multiple database and where the sources can be homogeneous or heterogeneous. What does this mean? The data can be coming from a single source, one source of truth, which can be, let's say, CSV file. But this is most of the 90% case cannot be happen because the data can be coming from your CRM system, the Oracle system, the uh, I would like to say uh, the data can be coming from the data lake or the cloud system. So once the data is coming from the different sources, so you as a tester needs to ensure that accurate informations are converted in the data warehouse format properly and passed to the um, next team who are responsible for performing the transformation. And the transformation simple word is say like a data manipulation. And here is the third part, second part, which is the transform, transforming that this is the process of transforming the extracted data into the form required as an output or in the form of suitable to place in another database. So here is the uh, part where transformation in a simple words, I would like to say you are massaging the data now. You are creating the recipe where the billions of records are coming and you are extracting only those informations which will be helping to answer the client expected questions now and if you will be able to answer as a software tester client queries then you are in a business now and you need to learn about this art and at the end once you transform the data the last step will be you are writing uh, the query which will help to load the data in the desired targeted system now so this is a simple process 
which is called as the ETL. And in the next session, I will be explaining more in detail in a very simplest way how being as a software tester, your part will come. Thank you very much for watching this session.